What's up you guys? This is Chris from Kratom Kingdom coming at you from Knoxville, Tennessee. I am Kratomed up, so I'm in a good mood right now. Um, so today I wanted to talk to you about going back and the essence of Kratom, like where it comes from. You know, so this is a Kratom leaf. It's, it's wilted and dead because it's been stored in my refrigerator for about a month. But there are huge leaves that hang on this. But this is all it is. It's a leaf. It's nothing to be afraid of. It's not like cocaine or heroin or anything like that. It's just a leaf. And I fold it up. Just like this. And then, and then just chew it up. Ooh, I feel it tingling down the back of my throat here. It's weird. It's like tingly. It tastes just as bad as Kratom tea does, but... That's all it is, is Kratom tea. Pull it out and throw it away. So literally, we're just talking about leaves. And these are red. I don't know if you can tell looking through the camera. If I can find a good one. See, these are, they look brown, which is, translates into a red. This is the pistol. This is what determines the strain. This stem, and as it runs down the leaf, whatever color it is, that's what kind of determines the strain. Some trees ha are brown, and well, red I mean, some trees are green, some trees are white. It all just depends on that stem color. I thought I was gonna wash the taste out of my mouth using Kratom tea. It just is kind of all the same. But I've got tons of leaves that came with my order. And if you want whole leaf, you, the only way that I know to get them is through Uju in um, Indonesia. And for that, you've got to have a Facebook Messenger account. And you just friend him on Facebook. He's online every day, all day, every day, because this is his job. And it's just U-J-U Owen, O-W-E-N, Uju Owen, um, on Facebook. And it's really easy. He uses um, Google Translate to translate from English to Indonesian because he doesn't speak English very well, which is why he doesn't have email and stuff like that. Plus, he's just a poor Indonesian kratom farmer, so he's not in any position to really... He's really good with his pricing. And, I mean, you're not messing with a pound anymore or a kilo anymore. You're messing with three kilos, which is six pounds of kratom, which will last you more than a month. Lasts me more than a month, so. I got three keys the last time, which has kept me in Kratom for. This is my second month now on the same key, on the same order, or the same shipment. It takes a little longer to get, but it's totally worth it because it's really fresh. I mean, you can't get much fresher than right off the tree. I should have opened these up a long time ago before they started going bad. Ooh, I wonder if my powder's in. But that's it, you guys. I mean, it's it's really just a, a leaf on a tree. And chewing that leaf like that, I, I feel it a tingly. I feel it pretty relaxed right now. All of a sudden, I feel a surge of energy. It's pretty cool. I mean, because I, I really, I just chewed one leaf. And that was one leaf. And they have whole trees and trees of this, a whole forest of this shit. So... I would go crazy. But I'm planning on moving to the Philippines. Um, I met a young woman there, and I plan on moving back to be with her and to live in a third world country. As an American, it's going to be fun. No running water, no electricity. It's going to be fun. But I'm a, an island away from Indonesia where Owen lives, and I'll, I'll go visit him and get, pull my own Kratom, 
and then they process it by putting it in a machine like a coffee grinder kind of and it, it, or like a wood chipper more and it turns it into a fine powder that we're used to when we get it um, but you could literally dry this stuff out and smoke it some people smoke it but I heard smoking it is not good because the, the flame actually destroys the alkaloids which give it its opioid sense but um, chewing on the leaf is really easy and the easiest way to get it that I know and I don't think you can get a whole kilo of just leaves because I think um, there's something wrong with it doesn't it won't make it through customs as a the whole leaf so I know he had a trouble getting these things through just I'm spitting yeah, I think uh, I think chewing the leaf is probably the strongest that I've ever gotten. So I guess it goes directly to your brain, you know, through your gums and your um, underneath your tongue and the back of your throat, and it gets in your blood faster, which gets it to your brain faster, which gives you the wow. Listen to me, I'm racing. My voice is racing. So anyway, y'all, I will see you on the next one. Peace out.